Mm -hmm. What was your first memory of like NWA? So just touring with them in general, like yeah, I remember in uh, Nashville, Tennessee, man, that boy Easy E had like ten women waiting outside his hotel door, bro. They weren't taking for me. They weren't taking for Shad D. Flavor Flav was even trying to get them. <laughs> Nothing. Chucking them in the S one W. They would never mess with it. Right, but right. Flav used to come out and kick it with us. <laughs> like, hey man, we finna get some of these bras. Yeah, Flav, yeah, Flav yeah, play with, with the shit. Yeah. And then Easy come out up to the door in a robe or whatnot. Next. That is cool. Next. next. Yeah, next. He would say next. Yeah. <laughs> like, I was like, yo, we used to get our little share of groupies, but boy, these Cali niggas on some other shit. But the first person where I really saw with a gang of groupies following them was uh, LL Cool J. Mm -hmm. Where it was about like eight bad bros following him. <laughs> I'm like, man, what are you about to do? And we was like, yo, what's up, man? He was like, yeah, what's up, man? Y'all good? He went on, he had the red Kango, went upstairs, took the women with him. I right. said, so he oh, went, he went in the room with eight. Yeah, he had a few of them following him. There was at least eight of them. <laughs>